the abandoned station. Who persuaded the others to go? I always tell them that I don't remember. I always lie. It is a safe lie. Or there is no way to ascertain the truth. Both Vitaly and Eugene are dead now. The massive airlock doors shrugged and opened with a grinding sound. Opening a road to hell for us, and a road into the metro for the demons. But in fact it all started that day, when Mother said we should take a walk in the botanical gardens, and go there by metro. I remember how we took a short escalator to the surface. How we exited a spacious glass pavilion and saw a street buried in green. I remember the small clouds moving across the limitless sky. A soft, cool wind on my face. Mother bought me an ice cream. That was the last time I tasted it. That day humanity was executed. The righteous and the sinful were called to be rendered according to their deeds. And we hid from God's sight in the metro. And we were saved from his wrath. And he apparently decided that flushing us out wasn't worth the trouble. Then he went about his business or perhaps died. While we stayed on this used up and discarded earth and continued just going with it. Going nowhere. I remember so many random, unnecessary things, yet I don't remember the most important one. My mother's face. She died very soon after the war started. All that remains of her is that day in the gardens. How I wished I could recall her face. The way she looked at me. The way she whispered that I have nothing to fear sell my soul just to recall that. I'd do that any day, any time. And I did. The Dark Ones came much later, from the garden's direction. The Dark Ones, huge, towering a full head over the highest man. Nightmarish creatures, creepy as a man turned inside out. Monsters born to destroy us. The word was they were incredibly strong and unnaturally evil that with bare paws they could tear armed men apart. Hm. That's all lies. <laughs> Truth is even scarier. Well, I used to live nearby. Before the war, I mean, uh, up there. I was on the train when it happened. I tried calling my family, but couldn't get through. What the? What happened? Shit! 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 What's going on here?
Wake up, Artyom. It's me, Khan. Nightmares, eh? No wonder, after all you've been through. Listen, I have incredible news. A couple of days ago, I was near the ruins of the Dark One's hive, and I saw one of them, still alive. I immediately set out to find you, as you were the one they tried to contact, before you launched the missile strike against them. Khan! How the hell did you get here? Get out! Now! Yes, Ullman, one moment. If a Dark One has survived, it is vital that you try to speak with it, Artyom. I realize that, as one of the Order now, you report to Miller. But we must persuade him to allow this mission. Khan! I told you to get out! This is a classified base. You shouldn't even be here. I'll take you to Colonel Miller. Follow me, Artyom. Get ready, Artyom. I'll be waiting at the exit. Move it, you windbag! I knew a smoker once. During the last year of his life, he had to eat, drink, and breathe through a tiny hole in his throat. We found this place a while ago, but I still can't get used to it. <laughs> Strange place, this D6. I didn't know they were built bunkers this large. The story is, construction started in... Привет, Артём! Артём was one of the men who found D6. They gave him a ranger's badge on the Come on, you have five more sets of dirt! Nice for him. Did you hear what happened? Hello, Artём. Welcome to the armory. I hear you are a ranger now, huh? We must get a drink sometime to celebrate. For now, let's get you equipped. So, first things first. You're going to need a gas mask. You can't make a step on the surface with a gas mask. It's been 20 years and the radiation still strong enough in some places to boil water. There are hot spots down here in the metro, too. Don't forget filters for the mask. Sure it looks cool enough even without these. Well, what can I say? Anything you need for survival and a stylish orange piece. Here's your advanced salary for this month. Remember, your pay is in military-grade rounds. Sure, you can use them as usual ammo for some hefty extra damage, but saving them to buy guns, attachments, regular ammo and equipment from merchants anywhere in the metro seems like a smarter move. Stuff, huh? Let's get you some guns. Take the ones you want and try them out on my range. Rangers usually carry up to three weapons, Artyom, and the choice of those is completely up to you. Ah, good choice. The Kalash is the workhorse of the Ranger Arsenal. What the fuck is this? What are you aiming at? Fucking sniper! I'll train you so you can hit the target with your rifle. Even if I have to fly you bastards myself. Now get out of my sight! Losing position! Close! Fire! Alright, Head over to me. Weapons down! Drive Drive the center of the regular dummy here. Congratulations! That one! Good job! Now shoot the armor down. Not a good difference. It's going to it's take good. more bullets to penetrate that armor. Look for sparks to penetrate in an armored target. Try a headshot. That's a critical hit. Not a good difference. Don't have to make it. You can keep practicing with the one or head on up to Miller's region. No way, the base is clear. There's going to be a big assembly. So, you're an expert. Pay no attention to this clown, Alex. Open the gates! Have you heard about Lesnitsky? What are you talking about? Check with the guards at the lab. Shit. What the hell did he do? Alright, let's go. The 
The tombs of ancient kings were filled with whatever they might need in death. Weapons, gold, chariots. They'd sacrifice their wives and slaves to serve their lords even in death. Reminds me of this bunker. Cut that shit out! The things in D6 are like what the Conqueror took with him beyond the grave. Cold steel, and wild steeds, and treasures untold. Of course, the Tomb Raiders would always die horribly, killed by demons or ghosts, or their own greed. Come, will you shut up or what? Hey! I heard that Lesnitsky did something! What happened? Nobody knows! Lesnitsky was at the lab. When the next shift came, the door was open and the lab ransacked. Lesnitsky was gone! Shit! So, what's inside? Chemical weapons, maybe some other shit. That's, that's all I heard. God damn it. The Colonel's going to tear me a new one because of Lesnitsky. A red hot poker right into my soul. If I still have one. All right, let's go. We might control D6, but it's like a damn city down here. All the bunkers, the nooks and crannies and exits. Still, they base the order dreamed of finding. Guys, just get back to the They say Kelsa is strengthening the sentry points along the whole line. Miller ordered Especially all our men assembled here on this base. Let's hear what he has to say at the assembly. I have a bad feel. Kruma, take these guys to Miller. They've been summoned. Yes, sir. All right, go on in. I'll wait here. When you've gone, I'll speak to Miller. The bombing of the Dark Ones may have been humanity's worst mistake. What if they meant us no harm, but were trying to communicate? Perhaps the severe pain and loss of consciousness suffered in their presence just meant we were incompatible. Machines with different wiring. But somehow you, Artyom, have the common wire. The connection with the Dark Ones. Yes, people died at exhibition. Your home station. Hunter, the best of the order, is most likely dead as well. And he taught you this. If we don't fight for our lives in this new world, we'll be devoured. It is the law of evolution. But I would argue, the old laws no longer apply. All right, Arty, and you, God, you have something to report? Yes, Colonel. Let's keep it short, then. I located the surviving Dark One at the gardens. What? One of those things is still alive? Luckily, yes. Luckily? Come, this is utter madness. The Dark Ones were the greatest threat the Orders ever faced. Colonel, just give me a chance. A single Dark One is no threat. Artyom has a gift. I believe he can establish contact with the creature. Let him come with me. All right, Artyom, go with Khan to the gardens and locate the Dark One. I'll send a sniper along. My best. Anna! Yes, sir. Why would we need a sniper? To eliminate the creature and finish the Order's job. Miller, you can't! It's murder! Restrain him! You idiot! You're making the same mistake that... We're done here. Escort Khan out of here. Artyom, it's your last chance for forgiveness, for getting rid of the nightmares! Ah. Forget about Khan. Looks like he got close, too close to the creature and lost his mind. Look here, Artyom. Complete the mission, and get back here quickly. A war is coming, and I'll need every ranger at his post. On your way. So, what are you waiting for? Come along, rabbit. Artyom, if it's true that the Dark One... And don't forget to finish it with a headshot! We now suspect Lesnitsky was a sleeper. But we haven't verified how Don't tell me you believe that bullshit about making peace with the Dark Ones. 
I wish I had been up in that tower myself to see the missiles fall and watch them burn in their nests. Come on, Rabbit. Would you let those things into the metro? Let them crawl into our brains so they could use us like animals. Maybe we could mate with them so the children could live on the surface and feed off the radiation. Shit. You don't shake hands with the devil. Please step away from the edge of the platform. Train coming in. Worn this place out. Let's move. Just a year ago, I stood on top of the TV tower and saw missiles rain on the botanical gardens, turning the flesh into ashes, smelting metal and glass. Nobody and nothing could survive that inferno. Yet Khan did find a dark one there. Now my mission is In the past, trains were ordinary things. But now, this monorail seems magic, doesn't it? Our kids won't know how to operate these things. And their kids will probably think this was built by the gods. this mission too. Power's working. Open the gate. I'll cover the passage. Great. You did fine after all. All clear. Move out. Right, there's a dead end on the left. Something alarmed them. Stay sharp. Shit, that thing's fast. I don't think we'll run into anything serious here. Great, the ladder. It's just a little more walking. Then we'll see if you're a rabbit or man. Surface. Put your mask on. Good looking at my ass. It's way out of your reach, rabbit. Give me a hand here. Let's go to the main entrance. There's a good shooting position there. I can cover a lot of territory. You're supposed to be immune to there. What? Influence? Well, I don't have your gift. So hop along, rabbit. Head on in and look for the creature. 
I'm thinking that since the Dark Ones are so fond of you, it'll sense you, or smell you, or whatever the fuck they do, and come from hiding. Just try to stay in the open so I can cover you. We'll maintain radio contact. And if you have second thoughts, don't worry. I'll do it. Okay then. Good luck.
Капитан Морган! The creature I met in the burnt-out remains of the gardens looks like a dark one. And it was able to enter my mind, dragging the innermost out of me.